Good morning, everybody. Have you having a great day and an amazing life? Um, <laughs> feels nice to be in the city. We're gonna go get some breakfast. So let's uh, get this day started. Get some breakfast, coffee. Because of like COVID and all that, they don't have like the breakfast buffet that they usually do at Homewood Suites. Come here and uh, you pick up. It's like a little to-go breakfast. Pretty cool. Let's see what we can get. I just want some coffee. It's the main thing. This is the life right here. <laughs> Got my coffee in bed. So for the plan for today is my sister who lives in Chicago, uh, who is actually moving. This is her last, second to last weekend here. Uh, she got us some tickets for a uh, architectural boat ride through uh, the city. Looking forward to it. Can't wait. And more caffeine. So, uh, let's uh, go over what happened to us last night. It's a new baby ready, by the way. <laughs> Crazy stuff. The hotel room that I got and paid for was uh, the corner suite. Got there, their hotel room. The corner room was amazing. The view was really good. But the cleanliness was not that good. And she found another nail. Hi, uh -huh, guys. Is that even we saw someone's hair in the fridge and someone's cup in the fridge. The fridge was kind of disgusting looking. Thing that kind of just like a cherry on top. At, at night, um, and there was a spider <laughs> that surprised us at night. Like, hey guys, it was a massive spider, and then I was like, whatever, okay, let's call him, we'll have him kill it. Yeah. But then I went to the fridge, opened the fridge up. What did I see in the fridge? A freaking hair, dude. I was at this point, I called him up. I was like, listen, we need a different room. So we got a different room, and it's not a corner room, so there's no window here. There's windows here, and the other room. Hey, positive. Hey, we're gonna count our blessings, we're gonna bless up. The view outside, all right. It's, I mean, nothing to ride home about. The view inside, amazing. You know why? Because I'm here. Day starting off to great vibes, great positivity. Main thing for today is that boat ride tonight. Cannot wait to get on that architectural boat ride. quick update my son and daughter dropped them at my sister's house now me my wife and the little one here uh, about to go we ordered some uh, online pickup so we can go and pick up uh, a couple burgers from Al Chevelle hopefully I'm saying that right I heard good things about it and I've been wanting to try it for like the past five years I feel like but every time we would go humongous line just to go in and eat and uh, I don't know one of the things that I just don't like waiting on is like food like not waiting on but like waiting in line for food you know what i'm saying like yeah, this is like 50 50 minutes an hour just to wait in line for food it's just i mean I, I just can't do that but um we can just order it now online and just go pick it up so from our hotel only a seven minute walk and i'm daddy mcgee right now look at this ultra dead love is love <laughs> love is love <laughs> come on dude <laughs> cheeseburger with the egg and then they give the egg separate ooh, 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 my goodness that looks great now this is without the eggs i'm gonna try it first without the egg and then we'll put the egg on so here we go Mr. hmm 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 i'm gonna not try with the egg before i say anything Egg delicious. Look at that egg in there. Now we're just gonna throw that on top. This is so sloppy, guys. This is like the worst <laughs> food review video ever done in the history of it, you know, YouTube. But it's all right. We're gonna just struggle with our way through this. Okay, now we got the egg on there. Just good luck. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
subscribe. The egg makes a humongous difference. Before the egg, meh. After the egg, pretty good. Thank you, Lord. Still sweating. <laughs> like, I swear, probably <laughs> like the worst food review video in the entire history. Like, I'm making this look so unappetizing. Like, I don't really, I'm not trying to, guys. This is a monster burger here. And the AC's off, all right? It's hot as heck today in Chicago. It's like 90, 90 degrees. Juice test. Juicy. Did you see that? I don't know if you saw that. Hmm. Is my face clean? I'm gonna edit out the empty spaces. So, you know, I'm just chilling right now. It's like off cam. Okay, so I'm gonna say something. Okay? Uh-huh. Shake Shack is definitely a lot better. It's too hyped up. Thank you, actually. That's a good segue to the next thing I was going to say is the million dollar question. Does it live up to the hype? And honestly, not really. Um, it's a burger of a different league, I would say, than Shake Shack. Definitely a gourmet burger that puts it into a different realm than Shake Shack or In-N-Out. Let's take another bite. Let's get in here. How much was this burger? It was $13 before the egg. The egg, additional 250. Throw that bad boy on there with tax everything out the door. You're looking at almost 17 bucks. 16, 17, yeah. 1750 out the door, boys. That's a pretty expensive burger. Am I gonna get this again? Honestly, probably not. I think it's definitely a try. It's not a bad burger. I would definitely try it if you know if you're a burger connoisseur and you, you know like trying different burgers in different places. And I would say, hey, why the hell not? If it's on your list, definitely give it a shot. I would say one time, great time. been uh, on one of these boats in Chicago guys this is gonna be super fun it's gonna take us from here in inland into the Chicago River and through the city so it's gonna be amazing are you excited yeah. Yeah. little guys really excited yeah you're really excited on the boat yeah yeah